Hello and welcome to another episode of Weird Canadian Kids Shows. We're doing the do, Baja Blast. And today we're talking Jacob Tutu, one of my favorite shows when I was a kid. The World Juniors are on right now. I'm rocking my uh, World Juniors jersey from when they were playing in Victoria and Vancouver. And I figured the episode we'd take a look at would be one of the hockey episodes. But before we jump into that, let's talk about, about what Jacob Tutu is. It is a terrifically imaginative, interestingly animated Canadian kids show set in the province of Quebec. The lead Jacob Tutu is based on the book character of the same name from Jacob Tutu and the Hooded Fang as, as well as others. I just found this show so fascinating when I was young because it didn't look like anything else that was on TV. It had just this pure Canadiana to it, which made it very familiar and relatable. I mean, he plays hockey and I was playing hockey. He liked pro wrestling and I liked pro wrestling. I, I had a lot to relate to this character. And the animation is just like, it's unlike anything else that was on TV at the time that I can think of. It was just so interesting to watch just because of its visual style alone. That being said, the show was weird as shit. Its animation style allowed for some extreme gross out moments. The show had a very uh, appropriate for kids, but vulgar sense of humor. Lots of stink clouds, lots of gross out stuff happening, snot and all that malarkey, but it was great. It didn't bother me at all when I was a kid. I, I think my sisters liked it too, but maybe it grossed them out. I don't know, that might be just a memory I'm fabricating, but it was awesome. Yeah, I remember like characters had just gnarled teeth. Like if, if you were a bad guy in Jacob Tutu, they fucked you up. They made you look as gross as possible. And characters would have bad breath and just like the cloud of grossness, like the stink would just be visible on screen and they'd all have greasy hair. And I have no idea how they made the hair look so goddamn greasy in Jacob Tutu, but I don't think I've ever seen another kid show emulate or replicate how fucking greasy they made hair look in Jacob Tutu. It was great. It had a lot of really creative episodes, which I'd love to get to another time. Maybe this is uh, part one of me gushing about Jacob Tutu, but we'll save those for another day. Like I said, the World Juniors are on right now, so I want to focus on a hockey episode. But just, just to highlight a couple, I just I remember the Library Ninjas episode being great. Uh, the episode where Jacob is set to face the Hooded Fang and they talk about anything happening in wrestling, that was great. Just a lot of really good shit coming out of this show. So yeah, let's dive in. This is Jacob Tutu and the Purloined Hockey Card. It's a torrid struggle. The Montreal Habs are ahead by one goal, just seconds away from winning the cup. Their hopes rest on rookie goaltender. I love how Jacob's a goalie wearing number 22. Fire! It's the save of the century! And the Habs win the cup! It's a little unrealistic that the Habs are winning the cup. And by a little, I mean very. And I don't appreciate the, the, the mild dig at the Maple Leafs here. But, but you know, it's, it's a dream. It's fictional. I love the intro to the show. It perfectly sets up how imaginative it's going to be, uh, what kind of adventures you're going to be getting on. It just sets up the world really well. The theme song's great. He looks so tired, like he's got the bags under his eyes. Just adding to the grossness of the characters, like their fucking gums are huge. It just looks uncanny. Great show. Holds up. Yeah, Jacob Tutu's great. Really weird and bizarre show in the best possible way. I definitely recommend checking it out or showing it to your own kids if you have them. A little bit more of a wholesome episode of Weird Canadian Kid Shows, just kind of singing the praise. I'm in a really good mood because Canada's playing well in the World Juniors. It's a beautiful day out. Like I said, the animation style is just so unique and makes everything look like so gross, but when it's showing something nice, it still looks a little gross. Thanks for watching this episode of Weird Canadian Kid Shows. Next time, we're diving into some shit.